Hello, and welcome back to modded Terraria. So last time we did the acid rain, and it was pretty cool. So today, we're building the house. Yay. Um, for aquatic scout this time. And I still haven't figured out what's going on with this music box. I might need some help for Blazing Tomorrow, because I've got it here. I bought it from a musician, but it's not there. It's not selecting, it's quite annoying. <laughs> so if you, if you do know how to sort it out, I'd be very grateful. Anyway then, I was considering building this one, no idea what that sound was then, above ground, but then, it's like, it. I want to do it out of the sulfur sea stuff, and it doesn't really look like um, the actual Aquatic Scourge, because he's quite blue, and then he's like rocky as well. And then, if, if Desert Scourge is underground, I think Aquatic Scourge should be too. But luckily, it should be all good. All we have to do is a quick trip. Actually, nope, I might already have some from last 43. Alright, we'll do a quick trip over and then build the house. Do scale trunk depending on how bit quick we build this house. And then um, we can move progress without like looking back for once. Um, wait, when did we have eight inventory set slots? Oh god. Okay, I am going to sort that out as well. I think next episode we might have a sorting day, if that's alright with everyone. <laughs> Um, I feel like we could probably get... Now we've got loads more chests with the twin stuff. There's a, probably a lot more, like... Ice Golem. Oh, hello. There's probably a lot more that I could probably just chuck in. Um, that is, like, hard mode, but I can't remember where we got it from. Okay, the only annoying stuff is when it's, like, a boss drop. That's really it. Right. Come on. Go on. I Ice Golem. I never knew he jumped, like, that, that much. Okay, what did we get? Ice feather, aluminium, and frost core. Oh, that was fairly useless then. Oh, magic dagger as well. We've already got that. And a tin helmet. Yay. Alright. Um. Oh my god, that's... Yeah, we've already got one of them. And it's still even that good for weapon. Right then. We should also maybe do the underground dungeon at one point. I feel like we could probably jump quite a lot. Oh, oh no, after Plantera that is, isn't it? And Moon Lord. Right. That's new. I have no idea about this biome. I'll just walk past it as always. Um. Oh, a cactoid. I haven't seen them in ages. Okay. Here we are. Where's this abyss as well? Because I thought, I think I got the wrong abyss. <laughs> I think that's probably the four in one. So... I bet it's all the way, like, over here somewhere. Alright, let's have a little look. Where is it? Oh, that's got to be it there. Oh, a chest. I doubt it'll have anything good. Uh, we've already got that before, so I'm just going to take the money. Um, Alright. And then, what is down here? Just double check in. Is this the abyss? I really should have got the materials first. Yeah, this has got to be it, I think. Yeah. And then... Oh my god, this is the abyss. That's crazy. Right. Oh, I do not like that. I'm getting out of there. <laughs> right. I think I should be able to make it without dying. Oh god. Save me. Oh wait, I forgot I had this. There we go. There we go. God, there's got to be like some equipable. Oh my god, I'm gonna die. Oh no, I thought I had 63. Okay. Bah. Oof. Oh yeah, true as well. I'm gonna chop that one down. So that's actually like a sulfur seed special tree. Look at that. There you go, you can have an acorn. So oh and coconuts. Wow. I don't it might not be a sulfur seed special tree then. Okay. What I'm gonna do is just grab about like hundred of this. Actually no, let's go for the hundred and fifty. Just so we don't have to worry about it again. And then we'll build the house, get a new friend. It'll probably be someone that's already died though. Which is always fairly boring. Right. There we go. And now. First off, let's just see 
what we can craft it into. Where is it? Oh yeah, it's all going to be... Nope, it will be there. So with the sand, we can get walls, which is good. And then it's just the furniture we'll have to worry about. But I might just use the acid wood as the furniture. That's perfect then. Sweet. And then let's just build this house then. So how long are these houses on the top as well? So this is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, oh I lost count. This might be an easy side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. Coolio. Then we just gotta do the same here. Door. <laughs> So there's there's the gap. Oh, look, this is where we'll start. Okay, so one, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. Coolio. There's another little expansion then. <laughs> Over time, this this will look a lot busier. I feel like because there's a lot of houses like underground, but there's it doesn't look like a lot. I don't think. All right, there we go. And then just got to do one more layer. I wish th this house was like directly above there though, because that gap is always a bit annoying. We could probably have a corridor maybe, but then that'd be a bit weird. Alrighty. Anyway, our, our village is becoming so like into the skies now. Like the underground doesn't really matter anymore. All right, where is dirt? I just need one piece. That Nimbus kills anyone. Look what he's just walking past. Hang on, I've got, I know how to deal with him. I know how to deal with him. Take that. Okay. <laughs> right, whilst that's going on, let me just try and find the dirt. There we go, clay. Oh, perfect. So now all I've got to do is grab all of the soul sand, or whatever it's called, sulfur sand, and then. <laughs> I hope this is livable in. Should be. It's quite a nice. Actually, it'd be better to do this side first. Quite a nice uh, bit building material this was. Okay. And that is where the door is, so. That's why it's one further out. I'll just put a door in now as well, because it might be a bit easier. And boom! <laughs> Does it really turn? That house turns my whole village into a sulfurous biome. <laughs> Could I spawn an acid brain here? Oh, that's a scam. Okay, rare calamity L there. So, what I'm going to have to do then. I'll use the walls for this, but then I'm going to have to use the wood. Um, does the dryad... Who sells acid wood? Hang on. I can't even use this either. <laughs> scam. Oh, go away, Rafer. You're my least favourite hard mode enemy. Okay. And he's gone. Alright, I knew something like this would happen. I knew I was feeling it, that's why I was so precautious. Okay, so the there isn't actually an acid wood set for housing, which is great. It's just a strange ukulele. Not even like any like marshmallow on a stick, great. Marshmallow. <laughs> the cook might be interested in this. Alright, um. This is a bummer. How long are we going for? Nearly 10 minutes. <laughs> what is this? Frost furnace. Acid gum. Well, that's a bummer, really. Um. I don't even need that. Um. Okay, that is the most useless, like, would ever. <laughs> um, that stumped me. What are we doing? Uh, okay. Oh, that's gonna make a bad thumbnail. I'm think. I always think of the thumbnails now and how like low they are. Right. Let me at least start by building this song. Then I'll make it up to whoever is watching. <laughs> Probably not that many now. Uh, don't worry. Soon, like three weeks, four weeks. We'll be we'll, Minecraft videos will return. Minecraft videos will return. I will promise you that now. Okay. Anyway, then let's see. Hammer. Where is the hammer? There it is. 
and all we've got to do, and we've also got to change these eyes, which is something I've just been putting off really badly. So I'm going to start here, and then it, by the time it goes down, it should just about reach uh, the platform. And this is for the saw, which is the most confusing one for us to build, or for me to build, and I have no idea why. Okay, let's see. Now where is it, Ron? There it is. This should probably just be enough for the arm, at least. Alright. I might extend it out a bit as well. There we go. Awesome, awesome. Okay, that's quite a large arm, actually. <laughs> oh my god. That's better, that's better. Okay. And then, is that the same size? One there, one there. A little bit. It just needs. To, I think it's just because it looks so... Uh, large, so all I have to do is just chip a little bit. There we go. That looks better now. That looks better. Okay, I am slightly confused of. Come on, I am slightly confused of like how I'm going to build this thing though. Gotta just extend it out a little bit there as well. Because the problem is, is that the saw is so small. Um, if I have a look, where, where is it? Where is the guy? Scourge from Prime. How are you e t tougher than Aquatic Scourge? Oh, that's the one thing I'm looking for. So it extends out like all of it. So I'm guessing we'd have it go like one there and then one like there. This actually looks pretty cool now. I quite like this build. It looked really bad when it was just that. Um, okay, that can stay there. I'll just take a couple of them. That should be enough. Um, we could at least get the... the, the Sulfuric wall, wall down, which would be great. If that turns it into a biome, I'm going to cry. So, if we do it like that and then do it like that, then could we maybe just have like. Because the problem is that's going to look like that. Um, okay, if I just chip off that bit there. Oh, that's it. That's all we need. And then just goes down. Like that and then I want to do it so you can kind of get like a tiny bit but not too much uh, no it doesn't really work does it doesn't look like a saw I guess we'll just stick with that it just looks so basic that's why it's just a, a background wall with it I think it's slightly a bit too extended all right if I chip it back a tiny bit I oh, know it's slightly a bit too short if I chip it back back another bit here we go. That works, I think. <laughs> Why was there a firework when I said that? Okay, anyway then, I'm going to end it there. At Blazing Tomato, I need I really need your help. I'm calling on like Blazing Tomato HQ here. So things I need, Blazing Tomato, with your terrarian knowledge. The music box, and then any idea for this. It has to be sold for a C though. Is there any like block? Maybe from the abyss or something that I can use. Uh but anyway then, thumbnail. Um, great. What am I gonna do? On. Uh, oh, and it's always night time. These thumbnails are terrible. Okay. There we go. That that would just have to do. There you go. Skeletron. Because technically we didn't really do anything with the aquatic scourge, but I'll make it up to you. What we'll do. Oh, and how do I get into the abyss as well? Those are the three. The three golden questions. After this, we'll literally turn our faces to the brimstone elemental. Now, just work towards that. And maybe do some past bosses as well with this music box. Um, but anyway then, hope you enjoyed this episode today then. Uh, be sure to like, subscribe and me. And I'll send it somewhere obscure today. We need to fight more of the, the UFO as well. But me and this small tower, we'll see you all next time then. I quite like this build actually. Anyway, we'll see you all next time then. See ya!